वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल वेलकम बैक सो डिस अबाउट माई अपार्टमेंट फोर आई एम नॉट रिच येट सो दिस इज ए कॉलेज अपार्टमेंट ऑन ए कॉलेज बजट अपार्टमेंट फोर दिस ऐंट नो पेंट हाउस स्वीट द वॉल्स आर विंडोज दिस ऐंट दे येट But when I do got it like that, I'm gonna do another apartment tour, and then we can just compare how things were. You know, I'm proud of my little um, decoration skills. My mom, I got it all from my mom, and a lot of this stuff was actually picked out by her. She used her taste and my taste to pick out some of this stuff, and some of it was just picked out by me. But um, I definitely got my skills from my mama. So only you, girl. only you come follow me into my apartment welcome to mica marie cribs baby okay so when you first walk into my apartment this is basically what you see so if you start like right next to the door y'all i'm so i keep myself in here i got the stick on the door both locks dead bolt and chain anyway that's not the point so i have this little key thing my mom actually got this for me i have no idea where she got it from Uh it's really handy for my keys, lip gloss and wallet cuz right before I leave out everything I need is right next to the door. Um these really cute gray curtains, they actually came with four panels. The other two are in my room, but I got those from Ross, like really inexpensive and they're really cute. This little mirror, um uh, my mom also got it from Ross. So yeah, I love this. It's actually kind of green instead of gray like everything else in my living room, but Oh, I just love it. So I'm a back up a little bit. Mm. Mm. So, if you look on the floor, these little uh two gray end tables, they actually were my mom's as well, and we spray painted them gray. I say we, I forgot who did it, but yeah. So that's what those are, and there's two of them. One fits inside of the other for room and stuff like that. But um on top, I just was talking about these two things on my Instagram yesterday. It's a diffuser and a salt lamp and both are really good for good energy and things like that. So um I have them unplugged right now cuz I'm actually about to head out and I just wanted to shoot this video. So um anyway, yeah, these two things are really good for good energy, so they're must-haves in my apartment. On the sofa here. Okay, so let me just This sofa is my testimony. I love this sofa so much because I got it for like $300 from Cleo's Furniture. They're running a special and I'd like to think I manifested it cuz I was like, "Lord, I need a gray sofa. I'd rather be a sectional." And they had this on sale and oh my gosh, my best friend Jaren is the one that sent me the ad and was like, "Hey, I know you're moving soon. You might be needing this sofa." So, yes, shout out to Jaren. He's the best. So yeah, y'all. Cleo's furniture, three hundred dollars, super sale. The pillows on my couch, I got them from at home. Um, those weren't necessarily cheap, but y'all, they're so huge. They're they're so big. I love them. They make me feel like I'm on the big comfy couch. So yeah, those were. I think they were twenty four ninety nine each, which isn't expensive, but for how much I pay for stuff, <laughs> you know. This little blanket my mom got for me from Five Below. This clock on my wall, this is like the thing in my apartment that I'm the most obsessed with. I got it from Ross. This is a picture of my parents, y'all. But anyway, it's so cute. It says the Grand Hotel Paris. I don't know what the heck that means. It's just so super cute, and I love how it's rustic. You know what I mean? Like kind of old timey, and it just, ugh, it just fits the whole little. theme in my little apartment. I just love it. So on this rug, I got this from at home as well. I have the same exact one in my room in gray. I had a lot of questions on my Instagram about this end table in my living room. Um my mom and I found this. Actually no, I yeah, we were together. Me and my mom found this at Ross and she was like, "Mica, you could spray paint that sofa and put it in your living room." And I'm like, "Mom, you're so right." So that's where this came from. Uh, I think I bought it for like sixteen ninety nine or something like that. And then this bowl on top with these little decorative balls. My mom actually got this for me when she was uh, helping me, you know, get the finishing touches on my apartment. Coming over here. Oh, hey y'all. So uh, above my TV, these I actually got these from at home as well. 
that one's crooked I need to fix that but anyway um they were like $18.99 or something as soon as I saw them I was like that's gonna go so perfect and it's gonna bring everything together and it really really does the TV this little uh TV stand my parents copped this for me at Ross as well and this also has the little I guess vintagey old town road type of deal type of feel y'all see my little uh what is that thing called y'all know what it's called i got that from ross too i get everything from ross so coming over here these little bar stools my parents hooked me up with these uh don't know where she got them i don't know i might ask her and i might tell you guys honestly she might not even remember but yeah these little bar stools all these little place settings and more rustic featured gray silver i just uh, i'm just so obsessed with that these cute little oh uh, i'm obsessed so my mom got all this cute stuff too she's she's really where i get it from if my apartment's probably cute just because of her honestly y'all i'm so childish look at this i love that thing i got it from the dollar tree i'm like i need that in my apartment and then these little um, coasters right here are actually from my aunt and uncle, Uncle Obi and Aunt Isha. And I love them because of what they say. Today is a good day to have a great day. And that's just something that's really good to live by. And do what you love, love what you do. That is honestly, I'm gonna put that one on top. Y'all like, that's my goal in life, that right there. So when I got that as a graduation gift, it was like my mantra to Micah, enter the world and do great. So coming into my little kitchen, y'all don't wanna see the trash can, but um, this little table, my mom, again, my mom, she got it off of Amazon, I'm pretty sure. It's so, so cute. And as you can see, you can let out both sides or whatever like that and move the legs under and do it like that. And you can do it on the other side too to make it a big table and i actually have two more of those chairs just hidden away somewhere in my apartment obviously it's not that much space right here so i have it you know broken down to the smallest version this cute little herbs basket and more little decorative balls all from ross all purchased by my mother shout out to you mama dear these little uh my mom again she's obsessed with just cute stuff and i'm pretty sure that's where i got it and she has a spoon and a fork in her home so she wanted me to have a spoon and a fork in my home so she got this thing is from ross i think and then i think she found the other the spoon from somewhere else i i couldn't even tell you i kind of forgot and the camera just got crazy so my apologies but yeah, I can't remember where she found them. I know one was at Ross. I think she ended up finding the other ones from somewhere else. These are just some little jars that I don't put anything in because I don't grocery shop like that. Oops. Some little mirrors, again, purchased from Ross. And they also have the same rustic feel where it's like shaded out and like it's worn out or something. I just love it. So then coming into my room, hey y'all. What the is up? Is Gucci man the G? Okay, um, coming into my room is really my piece. So, of course, I'm watching Micah Marie on YouTube. Like, subscribe, all of that, honey. So, um, anyway, that's my TV. I usually have my diffuser on top of this little uh, black thing right here. I just was using it yesterday, so it's still sitting out in the living room. These are the other two panels of the curtains I was telling you guys about from Ross. These are a DIY that I'll forever be proud of. Um, these were just some canvases actually repurposed. My mother and father had them in their room. And um, I took some marble contact paper off of Amazon got kind of creative with the colors that i wanted got some rhinestones and yeah i made these cute little canvases so if you guys want to diy on how i did those i'd be more than happy to show you because i'm just really proud of my little diy canvases that lamp is actually from my sister-in-law she gave it to me when she moved here from florida um that's just my little fan y'all see the other end table the gray one that I was stacked up. Yeah, that's the other one. You know, you gotta have a fan blowing in my face when I go to sleep. 
have a little M above my bed so people know what is up. That's my um, homecoming queen crown from high school. I have that on my bed just as a reminder that I'm a princess, I'm a queen at all times. Um, all of these pillows have been accumulated from my college career. I kind of um, bought them at different times. The comforter I got from Ross and this throw blanket, the gray one, is from Walmart. And um, like I said, all these pillows are just from different places, from Walmart, Target, Ross, just places like that. Nothing, nothing too fancy, but enough to, you know, make it look decorative and like I put effort into my little home. So this is the carpet that's just like the one in the living room, the pink. This one's just in gray. So I got those two exact things. So coming into my bathroom, I know it's kind of weird. I have a carpet on my bathroom floor because I just do not like cold floors, especially in out of the shower, walking around in the morning. So yes, I have a carpet on my floor. I'm pretty sure this is from Roth as well. This little um, ottoman that I have in my bathroom, I um, sit stuff there when I'm in the shower and I also use it to do my makeup in the morning. So it's really handy. I um, move it to over to my little counter where I do my makeup and things so right here by my uh, mirror I have this little thing that says sparkle and my sister got it for me and I'm almost 100% sure she got that from Ross as well but um, I love this thing because she believes in my little career as much as I do and so it just meant a lot to me that she got me that it says sparkle and it's just a reminder to do it every single day um, I love the little lights above that's so like youtube -y, makeup roomy. of course i have a little mirror i use this for my eyelashes every day this little zen garden actually my line sister got that for me for uh we did like a little we call it a merry ho-ho but it was like a little secret santa or whatever um this is actually these are from my ex um he knows me very very well and just got me that because it's just really cute he got this one from a pink victoria's secret just some oil sleek and then this just adorable face and body shimmer poof. Like, I don't probably never want to use it. It's just so cute as decoration and stuff like that. This is a little ashtray. And this is um, some lavender body butter. And my sister in law and brother actually got me that for Hanukkah. Coming over here, this is just my little for soap. This is a little speaker I buy too when I'm in the shower. This is just a little, um, parents got me this too. Oh, they just know me so well. This is just a little tray that I sit stuff that I need in. And um, they got these from Ross as well. These cute little containers. They're pink with pearls. And then this one is not pink with pearls, but just kind of really adorable. I don't even know what to call that, but it's just really cute. And yeah, there's my degree that I don't know what to do with. <laughs> I really don't. But anyway, this over here is the toilet. You don't want to see that. But this is just this cute little Betsy Johnson basket. It's full of crap, so I don't want you to see that. But it's snakeskin. Oh, it's just so cute. And then it reminds me of the rest of the, the vintage old, rustic feel. There's a little pinky, and it has an 11 on it and a pearl bracelet. And every side has a different thing on it. So cute shout out to my pops he got me that and yeah I honestly that's my shower I know y'all don't want to see that but I feel like that's the the meat and the potatoes I don't want to go in in too much detail and bore you guys but yeah this is just my humble abode this is where I stay this is where this is where it all goes down that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys really enjoy being in my apartment, being in my humble abode, but it is now time for me to go. If you enjoy my apartment tour, be sure to give my video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, turn your notifications on for my channel, and be sure to follow me on Instagram at Mike and Marie X. I keep stumbling and fumbling over all my words today. It's just time for me to go. So thank you guys for starting your week off with me. I just did it again. And I hope the rest of your week is fine like wine and Mike and Marie. I have got to go.